you need to do some Christmas shopping, why not check out a craft fair at Appleton North High School? You'll be helping some clubs and teams at the same time, and you get a lot of stuff done for the holidays. Artist Lisa Ritchie joins us live this morning. Hi, Lisa. Hi, good morning, Rachel. Lisa, tell us about your artwork. Uh, well, here it is. I do a lot of different um, styles. I like to use a lot of different textures in my artwork. I like to make bright, fun pieces. Um, stuff that you're going to want to look at every day that just make you feel good. I like to use a lot of texture in my pieces. And as you can see on the, the brown background in the back here, the, the middle of my flowers, I reuse my leftover paint. Smart. So I peel it up off of the palette, and it just gives it a, a cool look that you could never duplicate. So I love that. Same with this little guy. I use a lot of bright colors. So all the middle uh, pieces of my paintings are all from leftover paint from other paintings that I've done. What's the largest scale work that you've done? Uh, the largest that I've done is 48 by 48, 4 and by 4. four and how long have you been painting? I started painting when I was 12. Um, I caught an episode of Bob Ross on Channel 38. Oh, yeah. And he, ins <laughs> he inspired me to paint happy little flowers, I guess. So my mom took me to get some, some art supplies after I saw a couple of his episodes. I thought he made it look very fun and very easy. So I thought I'd give it a shot. Well, your art certainly does look happy. That's what I love about it. It's bright, it's happy, and it'll be at the Artisan Fair at Appleton North High School this Saturday. Um, have you been part of this before, Lisa? I have not. This is my first year, um, so I'm looking forward to it. I've heard very good things, and, and I'm happy to support their booster club. Excellent. So hope, hopefully people come out and visit us. Well, I'm sure they will after they've seen your works of art. Lisa Ritchie, thanks so much for joining us, and have a great weekend. Thank you very much. And we'll, of course, put that information on our website if you'd like to go.